Hello, welcome back to Fallout 76. We are continuing. Whoa, that came up quick. With our uh, investigation, our searching, our exploring of downtown Charleston. I cannot see inside there. That was a miss. Yeah, so we got here in the last episode. Please, 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 Anuka. Nope. Uh, basically, because we came here after the coffee. Let's read this. It was never just a coffee shop. It was a meeting point. A chance to see neighbors, friends. Just knowing there were other people in the city that you recognized was a small piece of humanity you could buy with two creams and sugar. All right. That, that's an um, interesting juxtap juxtaposition. Struggle with that for some reason. Versus our, the letter we got from um, Slocum's Joe just outside of the, the, uh, the, the Wayward. I was talking about it, complaining about the price of coffee. A post-apocalyptic culinary review by Glenn Ramos. I'll be honest with you, if one good thing came out of this godforsaken apocalypse... It said, I'll never have to drink a cup of Slocum's Joe coffee again. Having to look at Slocum's Joe employee in the eyes, hand them my $28 and thank them for the stale, acidic rubbish they'd just given me was a far worse, was far a fate worse than nuclear hellfire. One star. This guy was all about it. Uh, yeah, so last episode we got the T-Fuse. And we are currently looking for... A specimen from a feral ghoul, a wolf, and mole rat. I think we can at least get the feral ghouls downtown here, I'm assuming. Just not sure where we will find the wolves. We probably will not find a uh, the mole rats downtown. Uh, although... Who knows? I could use a bench because we are over encumbered. I could probably drop a silly weapon that I picked up. Let's take a look. Yeah, this hunting rifle. Oh, although that's not bad. That is not bad. We're going to drop it though. Yep. I had to think about that. <laughs> All right. All right, so when we were up there, we heard something breathing down here. So this just circles back up to here. Okay. Oh, we shot you, yep. Oh, I can hear the breathing again. What's, what's, what is making this glow? Uh, might be something up on the bridge. Is there a fire up on the bridge? There is. That's a pretty impressive glow. Oh, there's a ghoul right there. Let's get a little closer.
Oh, we created something. All right, this should be our sample. No, don't tell me. There it is. Collect blood sample. What happened down in here? Got all this blood stains going. Oh, Lord, look at that. That's a raider corpse. Let's take those cans. All right, we're going to head upstairs in just a moment. And a responder corpse. Raider and responder. I wonder what you were. Guess the only thing left would be a settler, right? Wow, this is all the way to the right. Pack. There we go. Scrap items. And then let's see what we can craft. I don't want to use the acid for that. At least not right now. Oh! Oh, Lord, that scared me. Whew. Came from out of nowhere, man. Please be something to drink in here. Some purified, some nuka. It's all empty. Ah, oh, come on, man. I need some I need some water. I need some liquids. Raider Corp. That's not who we oh there's two bodies here the raider corpse and, and it was a settler I was right wow they were tussling and started to fall through I think we have a decent amount of food that we need to cook. I have a feeling that's the case. All right, we're going up to the third level. Let's go. Oh, where'd you come from? Where'd you come from? Seriously, where did you come from? room kind of stands out a little bit. Is there a reason why it does?
Probably should not have wasted a shotgun shell on that, but oh well, we did. Empty footlocker. I don't like seeing that. Nothing in here. Nothing at all. Huh. This room definitely does seem to stick out a little bit to me. Especially here. I don't know. Alright, so I think that's it for this building. So we're continuing on the outskirts of town here. Should see what we have going on over here. There should have been another body back here. There you go. See anything down there? Let's head on up. Nothing. Wow, that's interesting. Nothing at all? Did I miss something? I don't think I did. I'm right with that. And not everything has to lead to something, right? Uh, it always bothers me when I see other gamers and there's a lo small little area or something. And they're like, why would they put that in the game if it doesn't lead anywhere? Like, dude, <laughs> it's life. It's the way it is. Not everything leads to something. See, and here's another one. Actually, I think the game that probably did that the best, uh, The Last of Us Part Two, Because um, I know when I did my playthrough, which you can watch on the channel at any moment, uh, and I've watched a couple other people play, is there's just countless number of times where an air, where you walk into an area and because of your expectations of what gaming does, of what game publishers do. Uh, so for example, you know, when you walk into an area that's decent in size and it's a lot of waist height or chest height um, barriers, you're like, oh, here's a boss fight. Here's a boss fight. The Last of Us did such a good job of playing on that expectation. Where they made you think something was coming, something was happening, and it did not happen. 
so good at doing that. Can we get up there? I don't think so. Oh, I'm I'm hurting you. Yes, I am. Yeah, and I just, I really enjoyed that because there were, a lot, like I said, a lot of times that you thought, here's a boss fight. And it didn't happen. Uh, another example is, uh, well, I don't think it's too spoilery. So I don't want to be spoilery. I don't want to do spoiler anything at all. Um, let, me, let me think about how I want to say this without being spoilery. Um... There's an area uh, do, 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 where you are playing a character and you are collecting items, craftable items to craft with, and you have a gun. You have all these things. You have access to your backpack, all the stuff for an entire area, and you never come across anything. But the entire time you're thinking. They're giving me all this stuff to craft. What is going on over here? Let's check it out. You know, they're giving me all these resources and I'm able to do all this stuff so that something has to happen. Didn't happen. Again, playing on your... Uh, your perceptions of what gaming does. What are they fighting? Are they friendly? Yes, they are. Can I grab those? This area just got obliterated. But what are they focusing on? I'm here shooting over here. Oh. Charleston Capitol Building. Must be something over there in that building. We've already seen one like you. All right, let's go over to that building, see what's over there. Miss. Oh, you're right up on me. Back off. Oh, dude. Enough. What the heck's that? I'm not gonna be able to damage that thing. That's a diseased crafting monster. And they haven't touched that thing.
What level is that bad boy? It's only level 10, but I don't have the weaponry for it. Oh! What are you? A snallygaster. What the heck is that thing, man? That was a level 14. Uh, it's just a lamp. What did we get ourselves in the middle of here? I want to see that. Was that is that what it said? A snallygaster snuck up behind you. A sickle. That's all you got. Where did that second thing go? come from yeah we're thirsty man I don't have anything. I have some dirty water. Oh, we do have some boiled water. I have to do that for now. checkpoint up here Take a look at that rifle. Uh, where was... There we go. Let's take a look at this. 55, it does, let's see, so it's a 30, 308, our pistol does 55, fire rate of 3, same fire rate, uh, see this is 96 and 70, it's all the same, 315, and it's, it's just heavier. Not as good as I had hoped, and or wanted.
Yeah, I knew there's somebody else in here. There we go. Is that a double barrel by any chance? No. Alright, we have a mess of stuff going on in here right now. I think they're trying to take on that Grafton monster, maybe that Snallygaster. Is there a chance there's a cooking station over here? I could use one of those. We have to be careful here. Yeah, we have to be real careful. Yeah, it's too far. Run for it. Oh. Oh, oh, oh! We got pretty lucky. We lived there, maybe. I was trying to creep up to get that note. All right, guys, I think we are going to continue in Charleston in the next episode. So thank you for watching, liking the video, and subscribing to the channel. And until next time, be safe and have fun.